All right, big news coming in. Akhilesh Yadav, Uttar Pradesh says and makes it clear this time that the alliance with the Congress party is still on. No dispute with the Congress. The Gadbandan is still tight, at least with the Samajwadi Party and the Congress in Uttar Pradesh. They are still in an alliance and it's on. Talks in final stage. Akhilesh big statement amid all that reports that came in of a rift between the two. Uh, we see Akhilesh Yadav now assuring that this, the Mahagad Bandhan in Uttar Pradesh at least is tight and they're going strong. Seat sharing talks are in its final stage. In fact, no dispute with the Congress. That's what Akhilesh Yadav says. No dispute with the Congress. Alliance talks are still on. The Mahagad Bandhan continues to remain strong in Uttar Pradesh. And this comment itself from Akhilesh Yadav comes right at a time when there was enough speculation that the two have not been able to come, uh, come to a consensus on seat sharing, which hasn't happened as yet though. But uh, an alliance is sure to happen, or rather the alliance itself is strong. The seat sharing pact is sure to come through. That's what Akhilesh Yadav hints at in the backdrop of all that speculation that arose about both parties, SP and the Congress, not willing to seed ground in Uttar Pradesh. Uh, they may just go solo. As much as all that news came in, here is Akhilesh Yadav now clearing the air. कोई विवाद नहीं है आपके सामने सब चीजें साफ हो जाएंगी बहुत जल्दी अब ये बात सब पुरानी हो गई अरे हमारे पत्रकार साथी कितनी पुरानी बातें बता रहे हो मैंने आपसे क्या कहा कितना अच्छा सवाल पूछा कितना अच्छा जवाब दिया मैंने और उसी में से आप सब कुछ निकाल लो अंत भला तो सब भला मेरी आपका नाम लेकर के निशाना कोई बात नहीं ये राजनीति में राजनीति में कई ऐसे मौके आते हैं लेकिन समाजवादी पार्टी की कोशिश रहेगी कि लोगों को जोड़ना लोगों को साथ लाना अगर पार्टी में कहीं कुछ नहीं कभी दे पाए तो समय आने पर बहुत से लोगों को देने का काम पार्टी करेगी काम सम्मान ये क्यों सोचते हो आप मैं कह रहा हूँ पत्रकार साथी क्या बात मैंने कही उसी में से सब कुछ निकाल लो और दो घंटे बाद सब पता लग जाएगा कांग्रेस अपनी सीटें मांग रही थी तो आपने घोषणा कर अरे मैं आपसे क्या कह रहा हूँ आपको चिंता और हमें इस बात पे फिक्र करनी चाहिए कि भारतीय जनता पार्टी पर्यावाची या भ्रष्टाचार की ये नहीं दिखाई दे रहा हमें स्वामी प्रसाद जी ने नई पार्टी बना ली क्या इंडिया में All right, let me cut across to Preeti Chaudhary joining us in the phone line. Preeti, Akhilesh Yadav clearing the air, saying that the alliance with the Congress is very much intact in Uttar Pradesh. Seat sharing formula is yet to be drawn out. Tell us, what are the uh, troubles that the two parties face uh, while deciding on a seat sharing pact? In fact, we saw Akhilesh has has very strategically stayed away from the Bharat Jodo Nyaya Yatra as well, despite being invited. Well, you know, Nabila, the big news that we are breaking right now is that the seat sharing is final. And uh, 5 p.m. is when Samajwadi Party and the Congress will make a formal announcement in a bona fide press conference. Now, what we have been given to understand that there's only one seat, discussions on one seat is pending, and that is the seat of Trawar seat, which the Congress has dug in its heels. They want that seat uh, uh, very clearly, and the Samajwadi Party is resisting. So it's only on one seat left, but what we can say and confirm 5 p.m. this evening, an official announcement on seat sharing. Earlier on, it was the, the Congress who wanted the seat of Hathras and that they gave to the Samajwadi Party and now the entire conversation revolves and the discussion revolves on this one seat of Travasi and what my sources indicate, in all probability, even that, that seat could be given to the Congress. Earlier on, even Banaras, Varanasi, uh, the constituency of the Prime Minister was one seat which the Congress was vying for. However, the Samajwadi Party has already announced a candidate from Varanasi and the Congress has now decided to support that candidate. So two, three seats which were proving to be a huge issue have all been sorted. What I can confirm and that huge news coming in right now, 5 p.m. is the press conference between uh, by the Samajwadi Party and the Congress Alliance and they will announce their seat. So, seat sharing has been inked. 
The last final round of conversations as I speak are taking place over one seat of Shravasti. In all probability, that seat could go to the Congress's way because the Congress has receded on seats like Varanasi or Hathras. So that's huge news coming in. Not that the seat sharing talks are not finalized. Everything has been inked and 5 p.m. we can expect the formal announcement. All right. Uh, Preeti, here we see that uh, the Bharat Jodo Yatra that's currently traversing through parts of Uttar Pradesh, um, we see there was an invite that went out to Akhilesh Yadav. He chose not to take part in it and very clearly said until seat sharing pact is not announced, uh, he will not join the Yatra. Do we know now if he's going to be getting on the Yatra in the next day or so? We believe another day for the Yatra to, to last in Uttar Pradesh. Well, I'm sure it's going to happen because you're going to see the optics. Uh, till now, uh, one of the main issues was of constant posturing by the Samajwadi Party. And we've seen, um, you know, every other alliance partner losing patience with the Congress because they were not coming good in seat sharing. The Samajwadi Party over the course of the last 10 days has already announced, or a week, has already announced three lists even without seat sharing talks. And, uh, you know, and some of those constituencies were where Rahul Gandhi's Yatra passed through. So you could see that kind of pressure tactics take place. You saw an Akhile say, I will only join the Yatra. He wants to join the Yatra in uh, Rai Bareli Amethi. He didn't do so. And he didn't do so because he said that uh, we'll only join the Yatra once seat sharing is confirmed. So all of that now is confirmed. The formal announcement coming in by this evening. You know, to, on a larger picture, Nabila, this is actually a big, big relief for the India Alliance because if this alliance would not have been inked, uh, you know, you go back to how this election in 80 seats of Uttar Pradesh was fought in 2014. And that was the time where the Bharatiya Janata Party swept Uttar Pradesh because then Samajwadi Party, Congress, even the BSP all fought individually. And that was the time where the Bharatiya Janata Party alone got 74 seats, the best ever performance in the state of Uttar Pradesh. So for that, yeah. to avoid that, inking this alliance now where the Samajwadi Party and the Congress is concerned, uh, you know, it's not going back to what has been the UPA. You know, in the UPA years, its usual partners. Samajwadi Party coming in for the right. India Alliance will be a morale booster. And the seat sharing announcement this evening at 5 p.m. will only bolster that. All right, Preeti, thanks very much for joining us with those details.